I love everything about cyberpunk, except this. This is inexcusable. After working long and hard and saving up for a new PC, I was finally able to play Cyberpunk 2077, baby. Since I was a kid, I've wanted to be in a super high-tech, futuristic cyber world of bright lights, cool music, and vast, expansive visuals. I grew up on movies like Star Wars, Blade Runner, The Fifth Element. So naturally, when I saw that Cyberpunk was finally playable, I was excited. Dare I say it was one of the reasons why I wanted to get a nice graphics card. I'm not in this game for $70. I'm in this game for an NVIDIA price. The sunken cyber fallacy, baby. And my review of the game is coming right now. I am not disappointed. It's an amazing game. This game is amazing. From the side quests to the side activities, baby. From the main story to the combat to the food vendors to the corpo apartment. I'm sold, all right? I love this game. Whenever I want to get immersed into this world, I don't put on a movie. I don't listen to music. I turn off the lights and put it in this game. It's a masterpiece. But there is one thing that I just can't believe. I still can't believe it. It's terrible. It breaks the game. It breaks my immersion. It's ruining the game every day that it goes on. And it's being swept under the rug. It's a catastrophe. There is no flying car. There. I said it. And I'm not taking it back either. All right? I want to scare my Jedi Master when chasing people like Star Wars. I want to listen to deep trance music going back to the city like Blade Runner. I want to fall in love with the fifth element in the back of a taxi while I escape the cops who are getting McDonald's from a cosplayer in the sky. Why won't you give that to me? Is it my bad looks? Is it my receding hairline? Is it my depraved sense of humor? Is it, oh my gosh, an update. Finally, an update. This is gonna be the one. 2.1 to be exact. Oh my god, I'm seeing videos of the city from the sky. Oh my gosh, this is it. It's it's finally here. It's here. It's gonna it's gonna be so good. It's 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 a it's a metro. You gave us a metro that I can't even stand. I mean, don't get me wrong, I, 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 I played it on patch day, but a metro. Okay. Me, I like it straight, so I'm going to give it to you straight. The view isn't even that great. I can't even third person the metro itself. I can't stand up. I'm limited in my view. And that's the whole point of the Metro, isn't it? I mean, you can go places faster, but we already have fast travel, right? I even have to button switch between perspectives. I don't have freedom of movement. Hello? This ain't it. I want flying cars. And because of these updates, the flying car mod isn't getting updated until like January, maybe. And I'm not here to lie to you guys. I like it straight, so let me give it to you straight. Sometimes, when I have the urge to play this game, I don't. Sometimes when I have the urge to play this game, I don't. Why? Because I want to get into the world, and I don't because there's no flying car. And the flying car mod has been out of commission for so long. It's actually been out of commission more for more time than I've had the game. So I haven't even been able to play it yet. 
And this flying car mod that I'm talking about is so common in videos that I thought it was actually in the game. It wasn't. I was playing the storyline for the first time. I wonder when I'm gonna unlock flying in this game. It's gotta be soon, right? Turns out, jokes on me, you don't. I'm severely disappointed in this one aspect of the game because clearly you can do it. There are flying cars everywhere. You even fly in a car sometimes. The Metro is a flying car. Sort of. I mean, the Metro is the Metro, but you have other flying taxis that you take in the game. You can even rewind certain parts of the game in the brain dances. That's crazy. But you can't add a flying car that some guy modded. Listen, all right? I love the game. I love it. It's one of the best games I've ever played, period. I want to join the other flying cars in Night City. I don't want to be left out. I want to live my childhood fantasy, or maybe, just maybe, I'll have to wait for the next sci-fi, high-tech, open-world fantasy city game to fulfill that for me. But I really hope I don't. That is my one thing about Cyberpunk 2077.